and two out of the 13 Muslims who were detained by the state following an alleged terror plot planned for carnival were released on Wednesday night, this following nearly a week of detention by Trinidadian and American security forces. The confirmation came from leader of the Islamic Front, Umar Abdullah. Mr. Abdullah stated among the 13 Muslims, which included one female, none of them have any criminal records locally or abroad and never traveled to Syria. Last evening, Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley, during a media briefing, indicated that legislation to deal with terrorism may soon be in effect to tackle issues of terrorism in this country. The Prime Minister also denied that the terror threat was fake or was an attack against a particular religious group. Later today, the Minister of National Security, Edmund Dillon, will be meeting with the Muslim Roundtable, a Muslim group to hear their concerns regarding the detention of Muslims.